Hey, welcome back to the channel, guys. This is, uh, you're watching Two Daddies and One Frenchie there. Baby, say hi. We're in for the other daddy right now. But it looks like Luna is gonna get her shots today. Oh, shit. <laughs> welcome back to the Two Daddies, One Frenchie show. Yes. This is Miss Luna here. Dr. Adrian, your boy Eddie. And we are headed to the veterinary clinic now to get her parvo shots. A minute time frame for a parvo shot for a puppy is around six, six seven months. months. We're at seven months. So we're a little late. So don't follow us. Do what, uh, don't do what we do. Do what God does. Do what uh, God does or what the instructions tell you to do. Just don't do what we do. We're not professionals at all. Yeah. Say hi. How much do we? Do we? Or is, yeah, 16.3 pounds. 16.3 pounds, mama. Uh, is this her first time ever at a veterinary clinic? Yes. Yes, okay. Yeah. Um, so she'll get the six in one vaccine. Uh, you'll have to come back in three weeks to get uh, the vaccine that'll be good for one whole year. Well, she, she got her gets, first. Probably. How long ago? When she was like one. Yeah, so you'd have to boost her anyway. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. And then she can get her rabies good for one year today. And then for patients under 20 pounds, we recommend Benadryl. It just helps with any allergic reactions that the vaccines might give. Okay. Uh, we recommend it. It's totally up to you if you want to get it or not. Got me. Um, so if we did the 6-in-1, the rabies, and the Benadryl, you'd be at $40.75. But we're also getting the um, chip. Oh, the magic I, chip. I had inquired about that. They said it was okay, okay on yeah. the day. What else do you recommend? Yes. <laughs> Maybe we should get, uh, you can do a dewormer. Has she ever been dewormed, do you know? There's no worms or poop though. Okay, but that's basically it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's do something And then are you guys okay to hold her for the vaccine? Sure. Okay. Daddy will hold her. I'll just do it. Mommy will hold her. Mommy will. I'm a mommy dude. I'm, I'm daddy, right? I'm daddy. I'll just need to take her back for the microchip part. Okay. Oh, worries. Oh, poor baby. Where do you normally place it? Okay. Um, right here. Wait, wait, can oh, you get, can you, okay, one more, one more. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you go like this? Oh, <laughs> oh my god! No! This is going to be great! No! That's funny. Louie. <laughs> The best time at all. Oh, I feel bad for you. I think you I mean, there's a technique well. for her. You guys will pinch it on the skin and then give it to her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Uh, the Benadryl, though, is a Benadryl sting. Some dogs feel it, other dogs don't. Okay. Um, so we just want to hold her nice and tight. Okay, gotcha. And you're going, you're going to work toward the back. Yeah, the Benadryl goes to the back muscle. No. Okay, then. Yeah. I don't like needles too much. Oh, really? And she sticks me out of the No. No. <laughs> You roll? Nah, you good. What do you do? You got all this stuff. Alright. You're the torture. Dang. So the six in one will go on this right shoulder. So we you, can, you can just hold her head. Okay, got it. Yeah. Right. So just cup it, yeah. That's fine. Look at Lenny. Look over here. It's gonna hurt so bad. Oh my god. She's a beast. Oh. Oh, oh wow. Did you feel that? Yeah. Like? <laughs> she got stung by a bee the other day. Big rub. It's so great. Big rub on her head. Big rub. Mommy, come in. Good job. Mm -hmm. Benadryl. Give her a big rub. Oh, baby. Oh, no. Get it. 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 Get you gotta go solo. Yeah, thank you. Okay, so just fill this out. Okay. With this regard. Mm -hmm. right. Fill that out with your information and mm -hmm. I will be right back. What's the yeah. process of the microchip like? You know, just gonna place the implant? Yeah, so basically we scan her first just to make sure she has no other microchip. Oh, okay. And then um, we scan the microchip and then, um, so the reader will tell us like the number of the microchip. Um, after that, we will go ahead and um, tint her skin and just place it right here. Okay. Um, and then we just rub it to see if it, you know, if it's in there or if it comes off or anything. So and then we a, scan like her again. capsule that goes in there? Like yeah, it's kind of like the, the a size of a rice, like okay. a rice grain, yeah. And then we scan her again to make sure that it is in there and that's it. How does it hold battery or power? That, I do not yeah. know. But it's <laughs> yeah. like a lifetime type It's of in lifetime, yeah. You yeah. don't have to like pay a month for fear or anything. It's just one and done. Oh, that's yeah. pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Five minutes, probably. No, like two. Yay. 
Bye, Luna. <laughs> Wendy's taking you. Damn, bro, Wendy just took off with her puppy. Where'd <laughs> she go? Where'd she go? This is all the vaccines. He's actually already microchip. <laughs> this is the microchip number we found. What? Yeah. So Did you get it from like a breeder? Yeah. Do you, are you still like, do you still have their contact number? Yeah. Why would she come back to? She didn't come, so it doesn't tell us the oh, name, so it just tells us the microchip number. That's cool. Um, so sometimes breeders will bring in the, um, the pets like to a clinic and have them microchip and okay. it's usually That's under good. the breeder's name. So here's all the breeder information. Okay, so, oh, it's American Chemical. So for, mm, How do we look that up for our, our, ourselves? So, so how does it add, how does it come back? So I would recommend you try calling, is it American Kennel Club? Yeah. yeah. So you tr uh, have to call American Kennel Club, see who their um, microchip carrier is, because okay. there's a lot. There's like found animals, um, home, it. there's a lot of, you know. Different breeds. Yeah. Um, so see who their um, microchip company that they work with is. Right. Um, Let's just extract that one for <laughs> <laughs> They'll be able to tell them you have a, you were trying to microchip her, that, you know, you have a microchip number. Okay. And then see if then they can change from the information that, because okay, so if we scan her, if you know if they found her on the streets, do you know what's coming to back shelter, to her? It should come back to them. Okay. Um, if they're the ones who microchipped her. No, but when you scanned her, what did it come back to? It's just the number. Yeah, it just shows. Oh, us, yeah, it doesn't true. shows the name. Yeah. So okay. when if like the shelter finds her, I think they're the ones who can look up the information. It'll show like the name and everything. That's cool. Oh, is yeah. there a shelter nearby? Okay. There's a shelter. Um, uh, behind Target, oh, okay. so okay, you can try to see if they do it or how it works for them. Okay, okay, um, cool. But yeah, my recommendation is calling American Kennel Club, telling okay. them you know she has a microchip, and if you can change the information from theirs to yours now, okay. because you own it. Okay. Because if they find her, it, it'll show American Kennel Club. All right, cool. You know, and then they'll have to call you, and it's a whole process rather than just if they find her, they'll call you right away. All right, so she yeah. did have her shots already. Didn't she she did, yeah. So okay. we definitely did the. Vaccines. Um, I'll take the microchip off. So your total is forty dollars and seventy-five cents. Okay. And then you'll have to come back in three weeks to get the six in one, which will be good for one whole year. Um, and then they'll make the appointment. Through it. From the vaccines. Sorry. It's okay. They'll make the appointment out there. Let me just. Is that one for the vaccines? I don't know. She can do that. Let's see. Maybe I squished the belly too hard yeah. when I carried it. Um, I'll go ahead and just make sure before you guys go that it's fine. Okay. Do you want? Okay. To oh, yeah, I got you. Okay. And yeah, you can just throw it on there. Oh goodness. Yeah. That's pretty cool. She's already chipped. I'm about to go to sleep. Yeah. Oh, the vaccines, yes. Sounds like a dental office. That's what it's my office sounds like. Looney. Looney's chilling. Are you out of it? <laughs> she out of it? She's out of it. So if we did the serenia and um, like the IV catheter in order to give the serenia, um, your total would be $96.65 okay. with the vaccines already included. Oh, yeah, How right. long is that time frame? Um, so doctor wants to keep it until 4.15, so it'd be about an hour. Wait, 
And that's because we she just was wanted thrown to see. Yeah, people. because she did throw up. Yeah. All right. Um, what happens if she dies? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We keep her to monitor her. We want to make sure when we give we give her Benadryl. Okay. Yeah. The Benadryl. Hopefully, if she doesn't have any more symptoms of a reaction, we'll give her a steroid, which will lessen the reaction. Also. Okay. Okay. She's a sitter in one. Okay. Um, so if she does have another reaction, we'll give her a steroid, and then we'll just have her there monitoring behind us, um, just for at least the hour. Gotcha. Right. And right. that you have that um, chip number. What? You have that chip number? Yeah, I have it. Okay, cool. Okay, so we're going to go look that up. Chip here. Here. Okay, cool. Thank you. I just got to make sure that... I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Lena. Off with Wendy oh, now. <laughs> sorry, girly. You didn't take the shots too well. <laughs> <laughs> that way we know, too, like in the future. Oh, Where's her chip? It's like right here somewhere? Here she, oh, no, she doesn't have a chip. Remember, we found one. Yeah, like where's her original chip? Oh, yeah, right here. Oh, right here? Yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah we just scanned and it was like, beep. Can't really like, feel it. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, I don't. It's like a rice grain. You said it. Yeah. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. gotcha. All right, let's go. Let's go do it. That's it. Yep. Yep. We're done. Okay. We we'll see you back at. Um, um, the Santa. Okay. Give me one second. Where is it? All right. Put an IV. Yeah. Woo! Those tacos are crazy. Now we're back to get Luna. Oh. See what it looks like. Let's see. No, 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 no. Oh, I can't even look at it. Really? Dude. Shaved down? Oh, they shaved it like a. Oh, shit. So Luna's back. Luna is fucking. Luna! Back. There she is. Just enjoying the sun, sunbathing in the car, through the tent. We're gonna take her uh, out of the car, of course, and review the the site where they put the IV. They had a bandage around it, but they had to actually shave it off. So just to give you an idea of how it looks. But the restrictions are for today or just to kind of, um, I mean, by the time we got home, we were able to take off the bandages, but um, it actually fell off already. So it li doesn't look like it's too serious or too bad. It's just a spot where they put the IV and then shave the uh, hair down. Catch you at home. Yeah. So that's where they uh, place the bandage around from here to here. And uh, you don't really see where the injection site was, where the IV was placed, but... Turn, lay down, Luna. Lay down. <laughs> Come here. Turn around. Turn around. Good girl. Yeah, there's basically nothing there. <laughs> but she looks like she's moving okay. So to conclude everything, it seems like she had an allergic reaction to... The six and one shot i'll list on the description what vaccines is in the six and one there's a booster for it that comes in about three weeks from now but she's looking pretty good today looking pretty good huh thanks for watching guys